Hi friends, happy Thursday. Welcome back to my channel, Sally Hearts Jack 80 here. And this is the Sally Hearts Jack 80 show. Hey lovey subbies, how are you doing on this fabulous Thursday? This wonderful, amazing Thursday. It is Thursday, so you know what that means. It's time for another Throwback Thursday doll review. And today, we're taking it back to 1987. We're getting in our time machines. And I'm going to share with you a really cute doll from a really cute line of dolls that I really, really loved back in the day. Wow, it feels so strange to say that. <laughs> but back in 1987, this um, toy company called Creator Toys made an 11 and a half inch fashion doll line celebrating all things fabulous and 50s. So today I'm going to share with you my wonderful, fabulous Peggy Sue doll from Creator Toys Bobby Socks line. And the slogan on the box of the dolls was, uh, it said, the fun and fabulous 50s are back. And the girls came with circle skirts. As you can see, she has her cute little poodle skirt on with her sweater and her adorable long swinging ponytail. She's also got a little scarf wrapped around her neck. There were two other dolls in this line and there were a couple of fashion packs and they were amazing. Um, there was Barbara Ann, who came with the Letterman's jacket on in a fitted skirt. And then there was also Norma Jean, who I had as well. But I guess because of her being from, uh, as old as she is, um, she broke apart. Like, her whole bottom half and legs came apart. And I could not fix her. And I miss you, Norma Jean. But, um... I had two of these girls, Peggy Sue and Norma Jean. So Norma Jean is gone. She went to Dolly Heaven. <laughs> and uh, so these girls were available. Well, that I remember. I got her at KB Toy Store. Remember KB Toy Store, you guys? <gasps> Loved KB Toy Store. That was like my favorite toy store besides Toys R Us because it was in the mall and you knew every t every time your parents needed to go to the mall, you were going to pass by KB Toy Store and be like, Mom and Dad, can I go in? And, wow, it was great. So I remember seeing these Bobby Socks girls in KB and I picked up Peggy Sue here and Norma Jean and um, I love these girls. So here, let me give you guys a look at her. So she's wearing a sweater and she's got her pool skirt on. They are separate from one another. There's the Velcro closure in the back of her sweater and her skirt. I hope her hair ties do not break. That's kind of the bad thing about these girls is, uh, well, any kind of doll from back in the day that has hair ties in her hair, they kind of dissolve, which is a bummer, and then you have to replace them. But so far, Peggy Sue is okay. I haven't had to replace them. And then she comes with, um, let's see if I could do this. Let me put your arms up. Don't break on me, girl. She comes with a little pair of white panties on. And then she also has her bobby socks, which are a type of socks girls used to wear in the 50s. And she has these little saddle shoes on that don't really fit her feet. Um, and they're kind of really cheaply made, but I didn't want to take them off and switch them out because I wanted her to have all her original get up on. <laughs> and she is posable. She has the knees, the legs that are... Uh, vinyl that do the clicking like Barbie did. Um, she's one of the mini doll lines from back in the 80s that uh, competed with Barbie. I liked it back then. There were a lot of different fashion doll brands, not just Barbie. Um, and I kind of liked playing with all of them. I thought they were great compliments to one another. All the girls in the Bobby Socks collection have this face sculpt. They look exactly the same, except for their hair is different. Um, and <laughs> the thing about Peggy Sue that cracks me up is this little piece of hair that's shooting out of the side of her hair, her head. I think it's supposed to be more curly, but it just is not. <laughs> and it looks kind of funny. She has really 
nice green eyes, and she's super beautiful. Um, have you guys heard of the Bobby Socks before? Maybe you have them in your collection. I love different fashion dolls that have different fashions from different eras. I think it's super cool. I love the 50s. Um, I love the 60s. I love the fashions from the 70s. I love the fashions from the 80s. And um, it's just really nice when that stuff is incorporated in a doll. Uh, I have quite a few Barbies that are from the 60s. They have 60s clothes on and 50s clothes on. And then I also, well, have mine from the 80s. All my 80s Barbies from when I was a little tiny tot. Um, but like I said, these are cute dolls. And if you ever find them, uh, I don't know where you would get them besides maybe eBay or if you happen to find them out in the wild. But I have never seen one of these anywhere uh at any thrift store any antique store i've never run across them so they probably weren't really uh mass produced that much and like i said i only remember them being sold at kb toy store so if you didn't go to the mall or you didn't go to kb toy store and a lot of times people just really looked at Barbie. They didn't look at the other uh, fashion dolls out there, which I think some of them were just as cute. Um, but don't get me wrong, Barbie back in the day was number one. That girl slayed all day, every day. So I just thought I'd bring this little girl on the show for Throwback Thursday to share with you guys, blasting her from the 50s, from 1987. This is... Peggy Sue from the Bobby Socks line of dolls. There were three in the collection from Creator Toys. I wonder if Creator Toys is even around. I don't think they are because I don't ever see anything made by them anymore. But they were fabulous while well, it lasted. And like I said, she's a really, really super cute doll. So thank you guys so much for tuning in for Throwback Thursday. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you're having a fun, a fabulous Thursday. <sighs> the weekend is almost here. I am so ready for it. <laughs> so remember to love your family, love your friends, but most importantly, love yourself. Be kind, stay positive, and until we meet again in this fabulous Bobby Socks world, you guys have a magical day, and I will see you tomorrow for Friday's show. Bye-bye, guys.